Hello students. I hope your preparation for CAT and other exams is well on track and you are focusing really well on all the areas where you are supposed to get expertise in. Areas like number system, algebra, geometry are the areas where you are focusing. Now students today the area that I am going to discuss here is geometry and mensuration where you see four to five questions of this area in almost each of the competitive exams and if you talk particularly about CAT even in the last n exams of CAT you will see four to five questions of geometry and mensuration almost every year. The students the question that I am going to discuss particularly here is the one that if you solve it by applying the traditional method or the long approach it will take four to five minutes and still you may find at the end of that that you are not able to solve that question. Whereas if you apply a very simple logic you can solve this question quite easily and that too with 100% accuracy. So let's have a look at the question students. This question here it's a given that a circle has a radius of one centimeter and then there are certain polygons which are circumscribing this circle which are referred by S1 sign and then there are certain polygons which are being inscribed in this which are referred to as S2 and after that uh, the given equation which represents the area that is L113 plus 2 pi divided by L217 and then these are the options given to us students. Now let's solve this question here students. First of all let's be clear what actually we want to calculate. We want to calculate L113 by that. Now students could it be broken up as L113 divided by L217 plus 2 pi by L217. Now students L2 are the polygons which have been drawn inside the circle. So let's do it. Within this circle if I try to draw a polygon having n sides what can you be sure about this polygon students? Can we say it will have a perimeter which will be lesser than the circumference of the circle because it is fitting inside the circle. Similarly, if we draw another polygon which is outside this like this way, you can see that in green color students. Now what can you say about the perimeter of the students? Now this will have a perimeter which will be more than the circumference of the circle as circle is inside this. Now students L113 are something which is outside L217 is something which is inside. So irrespective of the number of sides it has can I say in this case that in this fraction the numerator is greater than the circle and the denominator is less. So this fraction in total will be greater than 1. Similarly students for this radius is given to be 1 so 2 pi will become the circumference of the circle and L2 is something which is inside so even this fraction will be greater than 1 students. So if you add the 2 what can you say? You can say this will have an area which will be greater than 2. Right students? So from the given options that way is greater than 2 shall become your answer here. Now students in order to learn this concept and so many more concepts on geometry mensuration and other such areas you should log into hitbullseye.com and create a account out there. I think this would have really helped you. Thank you so much. Happy learning.